Good day, fuckers. This is a bit fucking different, isn't it? No car. Still wearing the same fucking shirt, though. Well, that's besides the point. Anyway, I thought I'd better put, like, put a video up because I haven't done one since Monday, but, um... When you do live out in the sticks, I've got no fucking reception, so this is still not going up until I go into town. First off, I'd like to fucking formally apologise for my little escapade that I uploaded the other night. Yeah, I was, uh, I was blind. Very, very blind. And, uh, good thing I did upload it because, honestly, the next day when I saw the video, I've gone, well, that's what I did last night. But uh, I did, I did, I did take it down the next day when I realised that um, nearly five hundred thousand people saw my um, saw me pecker. So uh, that was pretty shit. But anyway, I thought I'd better apologise for that because um, it was dumb, and I can promise you it's not going to happen again. So I'm moving that to the side. As always, I'm here fucking winch about something. Well, fuck me. What else is new? I was on my way home just before, driving on through town and whatnot. Got up to the 80k zone, right? 80k's now. I'm Fairly scared, my brakes are shot for a start. And some fucking muppet, right, is sitting there at the intersection, seems to be coming, and then decides he wants to fucking pull out in front of me. And I'm sitting there going, okay, yep, yeah, no worries, fine. You know, heaps of space, he's got heaps of time to get up to the right speed. But as it turns out, it was not his intention at all to do the fucking speed limit. No! No, no, his intention was to, um, fucking piss me off. Because what he actually did, really fucking did just that. Because this wanker pulls out and starts doing 40 fucking kilometers an hour. So all that means I had to jump on the fucking acres quicker than a prostitute could jump on a paying customer. And it's been raining for the last few weeks out here, so the roads are fucking slippier than a butcher's cock at the moment. So I've locked up, come fucking skirting in behind him, our boy would have fucking missed him by a bee's dick. What, are you fucking serious? Like, I don't mind you wanting to be a safe driver and a cautious driver, I'm fucking not whinging about that. But you're not doing a real good fucking job if you pull down in front of speeding cars with the intention of doing half the fucking speed limit. You are an asshole! But it's not only that that shits me off, it's the fact that if I was to have smacked him, I'd have been fucking, I would have gotten this shit for it. Why? Because the insurance company's a bunch of dicks. Because it seems to me in their eyes, you're always the one that fucks up. Actually, now that I think about it, it shouldn't be called insurance, it should be called in case you fuck up. Because again, when they look at you, you fucked up. And the other fucked up thing about it is, I have to kneel and sell my fucking lung on the black market to pay for insurance every year. And yet, when I do fuck up, I still have to pay this fucking excess shit. So, I have to pay X amount every year, X amount every month, and then I have to pay an X amount for when I fuck up. What the fuck?! But on top of that, when your reason isn't good enough for them to let you take your insurance out, they're not going to give it to you! What the fuck am I paying for then? Oh, I know, it might be another fucking tax! And you all know how much that pisses me off! Anyway, it's fucking Friday, I'm going to go get fucking blind, so I'll catch you later, I'm out!